Your Royal Highnesses, the Honourable Deputy Prime Minister, also my classmate, <laughs> former classmate, and Minister for Terrorism, Abe Vlagati, the Masilela family, visiting guests from beyond our borders, captains of industry, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. I am honored to address this special occasion, being the 2022 lack of the number 43 Trilony Park Guamagogo event. For two years, we have missed meeting and interacting with each other. So from that perspective, this is a special welcome to all of you. Before I proceed, with my short remarks, allow me to extend a special and warm welcome to visiting athletes and other dignitaries from South Africa and other countries in the region. I also want to congratulate the winners of this year's race to all athletes who took part in this historic event. Thank you for abandoning this iconic project. Thank you for not abandoning this iconic project when it was abruptly placed on hold by the ravaging pandemic. Ladies and gentlemen, today you ran with renewed vigor and purpose, and reminded us that no force is mighty enough to, tear, to deter the human spirit. Program director, the number 43 Trelawney Park run is not an ordinary race. It is historic, symbolic, iconic, as it reminds our people of the human triumph, unity and tight family bones that prevailed over an oppressive and divisive, divisive apartheid system in neighboring South Africa, which was carefully designed to divide and defeat our people. We are grateful to ordinary individuals like Makoko and many others who not only defied and escaped the tight grip of the system, but went on write their own humble yet symbolic story. At the height of the brutal system, these selfless individuals opened their homes and shared the little they had with fellow brothers and sisters who were desperate to escape the harsh conditions back home. It is in honor of this story of humanity love and courage that every year athletes and now golfers from South Africa and Eswatini come together to participate in an event that is just about competition, that is not just about competition, but is also about friendship, brotherhood, and good neighborhood. 
Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, history is a very powerful tool by which we remind ourselves and those who will come after us about who we are and where we come from. We need jealously, we need to jealously safeguard our history so that those who will come many years after we are gone are not confused and disillusioned about their identity and how they are connected to their neighbors and others around them. <laughs> Projects like the number 43 Trelawney Park are an important ink with which this generation led by the Masilela family is writing and narrating the strong historical ties between the two neighbors, Eswatini and South Africa. It is for this reason that we remain grateful to this family for keeping this light shining and stakeholders and friends of this project, we pledge our continued support. It is our firm belief and hope that this project would become the main library and a melting pot of the rich, historical, umbilical relationship between the people of South Africa as Eswatini and the region. We wish to thank his Majesty's government for consistently associating itself with this project. The Deputy Prime Minister is here. It is through the continuous endorsement and support of His Majesty and his government that we have seen this project grow in leaps and bounds. We recognize, dumbly welcome golfers whom I understand had a, a tournament yesterday. This year, more stakeholders, partners, and other interested parties joined the project, giving us hope that its future looks very bright. The growth of a project such as this one is also good for tourism, economic integration, and stronger social ties between our two countries. To our brothers and sisters and friends from South Africa and other parts of our beautiful continent, once again, I welcome you to your second home. We look forward to spending some special moments with you this evening as we celebrate the shared part of our history. And if you have time after tonight, I invite you to visit one or two of our tourism sites so that hey. <laughs> so that you take more beautiful and lasting memories of the kingdom. The Minister for Tourism is right in front of me. Ladies and gentlemen, as the curtain comes down on the weekend's festivities, allow me to thank you all and wish you God's rich blessings. 
my deepest gratitude also goes to the organizers of this event. Thank you all, and I hope to see all of you again in future races. Thank you. God bless you.